how to draw MIDI notes by hand with GarageBand specifically. You actually don't need a MIDI controller like the one I have here, or you don't even need to use musical typing if you don't want to. You can actually draw the MIDI notes in by hand just using the piano roll editor, and I'll show you how to do this in this video. And by the way, this is actually just a snippet um, from a larger course that I have. It's a full course on GarageBand. It's like two hours long. I'll leave a link in the description. It's totally free. Go check it out if you want that more kind of start to finish everything you need to know about GarageBand for beginners. Just go check that one out if you're interested in that kind of thing. But if you just want to know like how do I draw MIDI notes in with GarageBand in the piano overall editor, I'm going to show you how to do that right now. Another way to actually, if you don't have a MIDI keyboard and you don't have musical typing, is you can actually just from scratch draw the notes in. And so let's say you are at your computer right now and you don't have a keyboard or anything and you can just look at my computer and you can see that this C4 note and you can see that um, one, two, three, four up from that and then one, two, three up from that. These are three notes. You can go in and just click and draw those notes into your own um, GarageBand interface right now and I'll show you how to do that. So let's say these uh, weren't here clicking and highlighting them. Well, let's say none of these were here, right? Well, let's just do the first chord. What we would do is when you press command on your keyboard, it's gonna change our cursor to a little pencil. And that means that we can now click here in our window and we can just draw notes in, you know, without playing them. So I'll draw that C major chord here. And you can do the same if you don't, if you would prefer to do it this way. So C. Now I clicked it in the wrong timing, so I'm going to have to click and just drag it over. And then there. So that's a C. And then I can add the bass notes, which is C3. Make sure it's on the cursor. And then a C2. And drag it over. And now we have a C major chord. And again, if you don't know how what a C major chord is, or if you don't know how to draw these notes, do a quick Google search on like what it looks like on the keyboard. And you can just you know turn your head a little bit left and 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 see it's like oh, it looks like this, it's this note, this um, this this note, and this note. And you can draw those in.